I want to know what you're most excited about. What I have become, and you can tell me I'm, to my face, I'm completely wrong or off based, or I'm a, you know, a stupid American or something. But I've, I've spent a tremendous amount of time, certainly in the last month and really in the last week, diving into the use of artificial intelligence to create digital clones as a form of communication and as a, as a communication tool. And I now have a clone where it's cloned my voice. And I would say it's about 95% there. It does not sound like a robot like that. You, you, you can tell it's not me, but it sounds 95% like me. And with the current, the current status of cloning with the services I've provided is you type in a question and it will give an answer just like I would give if I were there, although probably better and certainly much faster. You can push a button, you push a button and I will talk to you. You'll hear my voice talking to you and it sounds like me. Yeah. And then the third option, which is coming on one consumer platform I'm using called Delphi.ai is it's going to be a video and it, it, it inputs right now. I have about five, thousand, excuse me, five million words of my content from books, blog posts, it's transcribed YouTube videos. It's ingested 6,000 of my videos and I can ask it a question and it's, it's giving really detailed responses. Now, I don't think anyone, anything is going to replace an actual human being, but the idea of this be perhaps being a thousand times better than an online course. I mean, I see behind you, you have a sort of a, the, the film reel. And I'm sure it's you know a, it's that. a real to real tape recorder. Yeah. Oh, for, okay. But certainly, you know, people who follow the history of film, when film came out, people's whole mindset was, oh, we can now film a play. So it would be a movie, but it would look just like a play. People couldn't quite conceptualize, oh, a movie can be this whole different art form. It's completely different than what plays are like today. And I've just, I've spent a lot of time grappling with this recently is if a clone can do this, it, it could mean if you want to improve your speaking skills, you don't have to buy one of my online courses and see 600 lectures and sort of weed through the outline and go in a linear way, the way I've planned it. You could just talk to my clone and say, Hey, TJ, I've got to give a sales presentation to five clients in the IT industry next week by zoom. And they do this. What's your recommendation? And you could pull out all of my years of expertise in a text form or me speaking to you, telling you, here's exactly what I would do if I were you, put together a summary, an outline, hit record, practice it, and I'll give you a feedback. Now, the feedback part isn't there yet as far as the, the AI clone being able to discern the vocal intonations and all that. But my understanding is it will be by the end of the year. So I'm just wondering what your thoughts are about uh, the other beauty of the clones is now anyone in the world could write with me a question or ask a question in their language. I could respond in their language. So it yeah. completely eliminates language barriers. And really for the first time ever, it it could turn communication into a one-on-one -on -one conversation. The problem with videos is it's a linear thing. 